Hi everyone. In this tutorial I'll show you how to fix this bug. In my project here I'm calling the Google Apps project. So I have this pass, this AdSense pass and this YouTube pass. This YouTube pass is calling a normal YouTube API and the money is calling the YouTube Analytic API and the AdSense is calling a YouTube AdSense API. So I'm running and I'm going to show how to fix the bug. The bug you feel is here. If I refresh my page to the one part, you can see an error. And if you, you find an exception here, you can see an exception is an irreversible exception that is you are currently running with reaching to the user of the Google API client immediately is this version of Google API client to run version 1.25 of the YouTube Analytics API library. So to use YouTube Analytics API you need at least this version of Google API client. And now um, in my project I'm using this 2.00 API client. So to fix the problem, you need to change this version in order to match the requirement for the YouTube Analytic API. You can see here, I'm using this 2.0.0 YouTube, the Google API client. And you can see I'm using a lot of Google API. You can see this one is using 2.2, 2.00 like this one. Also, you can see this one for Torable API is using 1.25 of the API client. I have also this one here to analytic API which is 1.25 which require the an API version lower than these two as you have seen in the bar. So we have to change this one to the lower version like this one. I'm going to comment this one because we are not going to use this. And the YouTube analytics API don't require this. I uncomment this line. That is I'm going to use 1.35 one version of the Google API client which may be required by the YouTube Analytics API. I'll download the dependencies by refresh the map and the And now I'm running my project for the second time. After it's running, because there is a problem here, I have to fix this one. Now I'm running for the second time to refresh. So it downloaded the dependencies where not previous added in my computer. When I run my project here, I will try to refresh, not record the YouTube analytic API. As you can see now, the API will return the results. You can see. Thanks for watching, my friends. This is how to fix the problem.